Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about FaceTime and more specifically, I'm gonna show you how to turn off FaceTime on your iPhone. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is gonna be a really quick video, not a lot of steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. And this is all gonna be handled through the iPhone settings app. It's this gray gear wheel icon looking thing. Nothing you need to download, it's already on your iPhone. So I'm gonna go ahead and open mine now. All right, I went ahead and opened up the settings app on my iPhone. And why would you wanna turn off your FaceTime? Well, that's pretty easy. Possibly you're a private person and you don't want people to contact you out of the blue from your FaceTime. Or maybe you have a limited amount of Wi-Fi on your phone and you don't want FaceTime to be eating it up and you prefer people to call you through the phone line. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. All you're gonna do is once you get here to the settings app, you wanna scroll down this drop down menu. Keep going until you get to the section called FaceTime. It's right down here by phone, messages, and FaceTime. It's green and white. It looks like it has a little camera. I'm gonna click there now. All right guys, I went ahead and clicked there and next this drop down menu happens that goes over your FaceTime. It's also gonna show your Apple ID right here, which is my email address. And then also it's going to show the ways that FaceTime can be reached through your iPhone. So I have my phone number and then also my email that can be reached through FaceTime on here. So there's a couple of different things. You can deactivate either the contact method, an email or a phone number here, if you have multiple phone numbers listed in here. However, you do need to keep the main phone number. You cannot uncheck that box over here, only the email address or an additional phone number. So if you don't want people to contact you through FaceTime on your iPhone through your email, just simply uncheck this box right here. All right, since I didn't have my email connected, I went ahead and checked the box. And then if I want to remove that, you just uncheck it by clicking on the line. As you can see, it has now disappeared right here. Now people cannot contact me through FaceTime on my iPhone through my email address. But if you want to simply just turn off FaceTime completely, go ahead and just slide this little bar over. It's green right now, which means FaceTime is on my iPhone. If I turn it off, there, now it turns off completely. Now I cannot be contacted through FaceTime on my iPhone, so it's a pretty easy process. And when you're ready to go ahead and accept FaceTime contacts again, just slide this bar over to the right. So that's the easiest way I know how to turn off FaceTime on your iPhone. If you happen to know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. But hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.